my opportunity to give you a little update on our plans for the next couple of weeks. I'm glad to announce that we're going to take the opportunity in the next two weeks to have a drive-in service at 10 o'clock Sunday morning here at Fish Lake Bible Church, located on the corner of Balkan Banker Streets. If you haven't been with us before, we invite you to come and join with us. Uh, we're just going to start that for the month of May. For the first two weeks is our plan right now. Uh, that will get us through the time that the governor has extended our uh, restrictions. Our, our restrictions have included any kind of a business being open for curbside service. And so that's what we're, how we're looking at this. It's, uh, we had a great Easter service here. This is an opportunity for us to have one of our more regular services. Uh, this first Sunday in May, we'll be having communion. We have a, a way to do that where you'll be able to uh, get your own uh, communion. We won't be serving it the way we normally do, but uh, we'll have it available for you. We'll join together in remembering the Lord's death. So looking forward to that. Not just the opportunity to be together, but to uh, be together and celebrate communion and remember what Christ has done for us. We'll also be putting our Sunday services the next two weeks online, pre-recording uh, the message and the uh, song service and things the way we have been. And we encourage you to be faithful in doing that. It's so great to have uh, uh, more than 150 of you following our services on Sunday morning. Uh, and I know a lot of those are multiple uh, people at one time. So uh, if you've been joining with us online, uh, we encourage you to continue that as well. We're working on being able to continue that even after we're able to meet together. We're still working on the plans for following the next two weeks. We're not sure what we'll be able to do, allowed to do, uh, what will work for us, but we're working in the direction of being able to meet together We'll have limited ministries, of course, at first. We won't be able to start all of our Sunday school classes and all of our children's ministries uh, until things are uh, a little bit more back to normal. But we're working on plans for summer ministries and things that uh, we've had on our schedule. We're planning on leaving everything on the schedule where it is for right now and finding ways to modify the doing and uh, not, uh, not change the dates. But uh, beginning this Sunday, drive-in services for the next two weeks, and then we'll be announcing where we go from there. We're also going to begin to meet on Wednesday evenings at 7 o'clock at our regular time for our Wednesday night prayer services. Uh, our first Wednesday of the month is always our missionary prayer time. And uh, I was organizing all the letters for next Wednesday night. That's uh, uh, the first Wednesday in May. That would be May 6th, I believe. And so we encourage you to come out for that prayer meeting. I hope there's a great group that comes out. We have plenty of room in our auditorium to spread out and maintain social distancing. Encourage you, if it makes you more comfortable, to uh, wear a mask. Some of you have made some really neat masks. I wear a bandana when I need to. So if uh, you can come out, we encourage you to have that first opportunity to be here. Also, want to make clear one more time that regarding Sunday morning drive-in service or the Wednesday evening service, if you're in one of the groups that's recommended not to be out in public, if you're uncomfortable in any way, our purpose is to encourage you and to love you, not to uh, make you sick or to make you uncomfortable. And so uh, please use your own judgment. We'll support you and encourage you in that in any way we can. But uh, if you're comfortable being here, we encourage you to come out Sunday morning, 10 o'clock for drive-in service, Wednesday night, 7 o'clock for prayer service.